light ivory ebony air forest dream. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see, I'm back with another video and this is an interesting one for me to make because um, as you guys know, I love nude lipsticks. I love nude lipsticks. I'm a nude lipstick lover. I've got so many nudes in so many different colors that I, I'm just that girl who always gravitates to the nudes. I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one. Okay, I even did a video about my favorite nude lipsticks, but this time around I wanted to make it a little bit different. I do also wear darker colors. Uh, if you're on Instagram or if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see that sometimes when I go out in the evenings, I'll wear darker lips. Um, I just don't take pictures at night. So it's, it's, it's very rare for you to see me in a dark lip. If I'm not wearing a dark lip, I'm wearing a brown lip, like the one that I'm wearing today. And I kind of got this idea that, you know what? I'm sure that there would be someone who is a nude lover, but would love to see what a fellow nude lover would wear in terms of a different, darker, brownier kind of color, especially when it comes to winter. So in winter, I do wear dark lips. I do uh, gravitate to a slightly darker to the nude or completely dark or uh, wine colors or berry colors. In winter, I really, really do like them. I don't wear them as often because I'll still stick to my nudes, but uh, I do want to share with you some of my favorite ones. So, in, so this in this video, we're going to talk about my favorite brown and dark colors lipsticks wise for winter. So if you want to see this video, then definitely do keep watching all right let's not even go far this lip color that I'm wearing today honey honey I love it I've loved it for a really long time I've had it for a while I'm looking at my phone sorry <laughs> yeah. okay okay So this lip color I absolutely love. This is a beautiful, gorgeous brown that I almost broke one day and I almost died. This is Derrier. This was from the Nicki Minaj collection. I'm just gonna try and not um, swatch over the whole hand because I'll be doing a lot of swatches. So this is a beautiful chocolate brown, but not like a dark chocolate, but just a nice warm chocolate brown, which is a beautiful color for an everyday kind of lipstick. I love this lipstick. It is matte. Of course, it does not, there's no shine. There's no uh, manga manga shiny what what business here uh, it's a matte lip with just a beautiful finish it applies on very very nicely it goes on so smooth and um, it doesn't have like hairs and fuzz balls and ew <laughs> it is a beautiful brown lipstick that just which can also translate as a nude lipstick. It, it also feels like a nude to me, but it is a brown. So I wanted to share that one. I really, really love this one. And then the next one, it's funny because most of the, the, the lipsticks here are MAC lipsticks. There's two that just aren't, okay. All right, the next one that I really, really love in the winter time is this one, which is Del Rio. It's slightly darker but more on the berry side it's actually more of a, of a of a berry color it's slightly darker it is a satin finish which means that it's very it goes on very smoothly on the lips it has a really sheer uh shine very very sheer not not too crazy not matte not cream sheeny but it's beautiful because it's sort of like that berry sort of pinky color i'm looking at the mirror as well below so that i can see what kind of color it is so it's sort of like that berry pinky color and i absolutely love it if i don't want to stray too far from the nudes i will definitely reach for something like this this is a nice color to wear uh in the winter time it's one of my favorites is also verve from mac it's also a really nice color i don't know where it is I, I have it I just don't know where it is but it's a great color that I wanted you guys to see it's a really good color the next one is diva now this is a completely wine listen red wine maybe bomelobo you know this is a really really like a wine color I can't explain it in any other way it is a matte lipstick as well uh, let me just 
I mean, I mean, you know, it's such a beautiful color. There's no other way to describe this color apart from the fact that it's a wine. It's a beautiful, dark, rich color. This is one of the colors I was wearing. Um, uh, there's no fuzz on this one too. No stones on this one too. Okay, uh, but this one was one of the colors. Uh, I'm angry at that girl. Uh, this one is one of the colors that I wore on a night out recently and I really, really loved it. Looks Just good on any skin tone. In fact, I feel like all the colors I've mentioned now look really good on any skin tone. So definitely try them out. Um, uh, the next one is an all-time favorite of mine. This is Sin. Also on the wine side, but this one has a little bit of a deep purple to it as well. Let me see. Oh man, it is beautiful. This is, if you want to create like a vampy look or something that's very deep and, but rich and uh, just, just sexy. This one is a really, really sexy color, which I would um, wear out at night as well. I'm not a fan of wearing really deep, rich, dark colors apart from like your reds, which I'm coming to now, but I'm not a fan of wearing deep, rich, dark colors during the day. I like to wear them at night and this is definitely a fave. This is always one. My sister and I loved this as soon as we discovered it at MAC and I just keep repurchasing it, but um, not as much because you know I don't wear these much, but when it's not in my collection, I kind of have a little, you know, so it's on the purpley, dark, rich, maroon. Oh, it's just plum. It's just, it mixes a really nice array of colors and it's matte. It applies on really nicely as well. Not too hard to get on. And I love it. I love it. I absolutely love it. Um, then a very really cool toned gray kind of color also on the brownie side but a little more to the gray this is max stone i love it look at that color i feel like i want to take this one off and wear this one but no we're not finna do what we're not finna do as my sister would say look at this color just look at this look at this color Oh, it's like a cementy, you know, a uh, gray with, with a touch of brown, but gray color. And I love it. Um, I often joke and laugh to my friends that when I wear this, um, it looks like I'm a weed smoker. Like it, you, it makes your lips. If you know people who smoke weed religious, it makes your lips dark and sort of like gray like that. But it's such a beautiful color. I'm not a weed smoker though, but it's such a beautiful, I mean, I've dabbled in weed. <laughs> but it's such a beautiful color. I love, love, love this color. And I also feel like it's a color that would go really, really well on um, any skin tone. With a light ivory ebony forestry. <coughs> All right. And from a different brand, this is from Bobbi Brown. One of the colors that I actually really like as well. This is sort of like a brick stone kind of color and uh, not that stone that I mentioned, but this is slopes from Bobbi Brown. And let's see. Oh man, it's so beautiful. This is a color that you can wear very, very similar to Verve from MAC. This is a color that you can wear uh, every day on a daily basis. It's a beautiful color, slightly darker as opposed to your nude nudes like your pinkies, your um, movies or whatever. This is slightly darker looks like verve actually quite a lot and i love this color it's got a very uh, sheer um uh uh, tint to it. It's very sheer. It doesn't shine too much like your cream sheens and stuff, but it is beautiful. It applies on well really, really nicely. Um, quite opaque as well. So I really, really like this color. It's so pretty and it's from Bobbi Brown. I had this one for a while as well, uh, but I'm a big fan. A big fan. And then the last color that is not a red, because I am moving to a red, the last one is a red. This is from uh, L'Oreal Paris and the new Ultra Matte Liquid Lipsticks. I had to mention this one. Where are we gonna put it? Right there. Ooh, ay, 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 ay. It is like a more, it's, it, it's almost exactly like Derriere. 
if you look at Derrier, which is here, it's almost exactly, exactly like Derrier, but just so much richer. This is a definite chocolate color. It is beautiful. I could have worn this as well today. Maybe I could put it on on top of Derrier. Nah, it's fine. But this is also really, 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 really pretty. I love it. I've got this in, uh, this is, what do you call this one? Truffa, Truffa Mania. Uh, I've got four colors from this range. I just don't know where they are. That's the problem when you when you have too many lip products. You just sort of place them everywhere. But this is a beautiful color. It's a beautiful brown. And then the last one is a red. I love a bold, rich, standout, makes a statement, confident red. I love it. And the one I recently got introduced to by my sister, of course. Who else? Because I would just wear... Um, um, Ruby Woo and call it a day, but my sister introduced me to this because I saw her wearing it and I died And I said I need this in my life. This is feels so grand. I am yet to wear it, but but hmm? 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 It is stunning it pops it oozes confidence. It's a matte liquid lipstick, of course. It oozes confidence. It sits really nicely on the skin. Well, when I wore uh, my sister's one, it sat very nicely on the skin. It just makes your whole face pop. I really love to wear a red like this when I have barely any minimal, pretty much like a light brown on my eyes and nothing else. Just no 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 blush no nothing just your highlight your contour and a and a loud color like this one i absolutely love it it oozes confidence you have to be really 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 confident to wear a color like that and i really really love it yeah that's pretty much it those are the babies that me a nude lip lover would typically gravitate towards uh in the winter time i absolutely love them i wanted to share them with you i hope you enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful if you're a nude lover and you're thinking oh my god i need to try out blah blah blah, blah. i hope this was helpful um uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm gonna go. I hope you enjoyed this video. What are some of your favorite deep dark rich colors? Please I would love to know because I want to try out some new ones. These ones are pretty much common to me except this one um, I want to try out some new deep rich colors for this winter. So definitely do give me some recommendations down below don't forget to subscribe, join the family, let me know what you'd like to see on the channel. I'll definitely do that for you. But for the most part, I am going to go. I hope you enjoyed this video. And Nizu Hamba, Nini Bone. Okay, I'm out. See you in the next one. Sayonara.